Reno. Cheyenne. What happened? Joe Don Butler. He's waiting for you at Mesa Verde in the canyon beyond the Winnebago. He's got Bobby. He sent me here to come and get you. We know what are we gonna do? Moms and our daughters, Kathleen. I have something for you. What do you have for me? This is a prize. A prize? From Lorenzo Branscombe Richmond and myself. It's a renegade cup. Oh, well, thank you. She didn't make it. <laughs> <laughs> well, fine. So I'll only partially treasure it. Printing on it, though. So. Very nice. And she took the photograph. Now, tell us about picking your son in law. I've never heard of anybody doing that. Well, I mean, I suppose well, they do. Well, you know, that's kind of what every mother would like to be able to do. Uh, yeah. you, you meet somebody that you just think is an absolute dynamite guy, and uh, he was, uh, at that time, he was single. And I, I brought some photographs in one day and showed to my makeup artist, and he saw them and, who's that? I said, that's my little girl. In a bathing suit. <laughs> but they, I introduced them and uh, I never really thought that it was going to develop as it did but I was extremely glad and I am now I, I adore Lorenzo and, and he's been a wonderful addition to our family it's, a, it's going well Kathleen the marriage mm -hmm. and the show's doing well Renegade. yes it's doing really well congratulations Thank to you, you both now tell us about mom's hidden talent well we'll see how far this unconditional love thing goes right <laughs> She can burp louder than anybody. <laughs> there are there are limitations on this. Show. Well, it could have been worse. <laughs> now listen, I heard this and I said, "Gosh, we could have kept Courtney on the phone because she's the champ." <laughs> and she said, "No, I would never do that on TV, Mom." I said, "Yeah, but you're the champ, like Guinness." Book a world record. So now do you have to work up to it, Abby? Or how does it it's work? a gift. <laughs> I know it is. I know it is. But do you have to work up to it? Like Courtney said, she has to work up to it. It takes about 15 minutes. Well, I don't know. Puff tweet usually works. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, I I'm don't sorry. You're talking about it. <laughs> sorry, you couldn't share it with us. <laughs> no, I think that's very endearing. <laughs> Who had a question? Did you have a question? <laughs> yes, stand up, please. <laughs> Uh, for Francesca, do you do material about your mother's life in your comedy act? Well, not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> no, but don't, don't forget to vote for me in 96. Oh, oh, my. I'm doing my imitation, Ross Perot. Please don't interrupt. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm. Uh, I, do, I do have one good joke I'll say about my mother, that we're the best of friends now that we're the same age. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I like that's it too. Good. <laughs> uh, that's good. Any other material about mom? No, I, I I don't talk very much about my mom because no one understands, you know what it's like. No one can relate. We didn't get to talk about you going down to the jail to help her when she was. Well, yeah, when I went down to the jail, my, nice. my mom can't 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 spell too well. Don't speak like Pedro. Speak like Francesca. Why don't you speak in English? No, you can't. Yeah, you yeah, that's what's going to happen. Okay, darling, I'll just speak. Francesca, uh -huh. wait, wait. We'll come back and we'll hear the story. Oh, you you have to go down. Okay, seriously. Okay. More celebrity dish when we come back. Uh -huh. <laughs>